Okay, we have an AT&T Microsoft Lumia 640 LTE. It is configured exactly like it would be as it came out of the package. Only exception, it has a Microsoft account set up. So here we go. We're going to power it on or power the screen on. And the first thing I want you to do, since your phone is probably already configured, I, I would like for you to back it up first. So if you'll put your finger up here into at the very top of the screen and swipe down. And then select here where it says All Settings. Just touch that area. And then touch the area here where it says Network Wireless. I want to bring up all the groups of the settings and come down here to Update and Backup. And then select backup. Now it should say backup is on for your apps and settings and uh, text messages. I want you to select apps and settings. And then I want you to click this backup now button. And then come back to me back at the main screen after you have backed everything up. We are going to install the Insider program app. So down here is the store application. You can also get to it by putting your finger on the right part of your screen and swiping left. And going down to the S's, you can do that by just touching one of the letters and then selecting S and then selecting store either way to get to the store okay once you're in the store i want you to click this search button and then i want you to type in windows and you should have automatically come up Windows Insider, you can finish typing this out or just select it. Next, the Windows Insider program will come up first. Select it. Then down here at the install, click install. So it's going to download it pending and then you actually see the uh, progress of the downloading and finalizing of the installation and I'm just going to leave it here now down here where it says view click view and then select the Windows Insider program from the program list first thing you want to do is Select Get Preview Builds, and this should be your first time. So it's going to load up the program, and it's going to see that you have not registered. So go ahead and click the Continue button. Click the Accept button. You can select any of these that apply to you. If none of them apply, select any one that you want. Normally you might want to select this one right here if not apply. Continue. And it's going to register you. Uses your Microsoft account that you set up for your phone. Once you are registered, I want you to select Insider Release Preview. Touch it. Everything will turn blue. These other two options, yes, you could select them. They'll put you on the development branch. You want the production branch. You've got some things here you can read to see what may be the implications of joining the Insider program. Hit the Accept button.
going to tell you it's all done. Your phone is ready to get updates from the following preview versions. And you're going to get them from the current branch. Click this button right here, the little uh, check. And now what you want to do is update your phone. So you need to go up, scroll this list down to settings, select settings, select the network wireless, then come down here to update and backup, select phone update, and as soon as you come in, your phone will start checking for an update. And it's going to start downloading. And I will come back to this after we've got the download. Okay, this will be the result of your update. Message just letting you know that uh, you have Windows 10 on your phone so you need to install it now so click the install or select the install accept the agreement and your phone will restart and will go through the uh, process okay after you selected the install your phone will reboot and you'll get the little spinning gears okay and then after the spinning gears, your phone will reboot and it'll go through various steps of installing. Just wait for this to, to uh, complete. Okay, after Windows 10 Mobile has installed and gone through everything, you'll come to your start screen. You go up here and check your notifications you'll see that some updates have occurred. And that's just that update. Right now, your phone is updating all the apps that are installed on your system. You need to let that happen before you do anything else. If you wanna see that, you can go to the store and it's taking a little time to load because everything is going on in the background. You can see right now I'm at 39. A few have already downloaded. You can tap the 39 and it'll take you to the list. And you can see all the apps that need to be updated let those update okay all of your apps have updated we're back out here at the start screen one thing i will note is that this tile is missing that app was the sports app and it is still installed in the system let's take a look very quickly at the build of windows 10 mobile that we have up at the top of the screen here swipe down select all settings Select System, go down to the bottom and select About. If you have more information here, select that. I do not because I've been here already. Right here is the OS build, Windows 10, 10586. This is the production branch, not beta. 107 is the build. Okay, let's hit the home button. Now we're going to go take a look and configure our Windows Insider and how we're going to exist inside of Windows Insider now that we have this build. You could uninstall uh, and stay on this build. However, there are some other released builds that are not beta. Let's swipe the screen to the left again we're going to touch the a just to bring up the full quick access to w 
and then select Windows Insider. Now select Get Preview Builds. And you will now see you have an additional option. You still have your Insider Slow and Fast. You have the Insider Release Preview. And then you have another one down here called Production. Let's jump on the Production branch. Select this right pointing arrow. Select Accept. And it tells us we're now on the production branch. Select the check mark. This puts us back out to the All Apps list. Hit the uh, Start button just to come back out to the Start screen. You don't have to do this, but we will. Uh, what we have just done is we have put our phone onto the production uh, branch. Now, as Microsoft officially releases non-beta versions of Windows 10 Mobile, you will receive those. There is an additional build. There will be builds every month, cumulative updates. So let's go Put your finger up at the top and swipe down. Then select All Settings. Then come down here at the bottom. You want to scroll up a little bit and go to Update and Security. Go to Phone Update. And now, instead of it checking immediately when you come in, uh, Obviously, your phone will do periodic checks throughout the day. Let's go ahead and check for updates. Okay, as you can see, there is an update available. It is Windows 10, uh, again, the production branch, 10586.318. And it's going to download it. It'll go through and do the same steps as we did before. The video is not going to take you through all of that. We're done. Just uh, follow your prompts. It'll do the update. It'll reboot. You should get your gear spinning and all that other nice stuff that you always see when you get an update to Windows uh, 10 Mobile. And you will be on the production branch, the latest released non-beta version. Enjoy.